Well, Mark, emphatic win in the end. Uh, yeah, in the end, I think um, the performance was good. I think from start to finish, just a little bit sloppy in terms of giving them chances. But as you saw, they, they throw bodies forward and try and press high up. They try and make you give the ball away. They try and make you feel that pressure. And, and really, on a slippy surface tonight, rather than a really poor one, we had um, we gave them too many sort of sighters, really. Although we got the first chance of the game. Brilliant. I thought Casey was was fantastic all night um, but that first run that he went on the calmness he showed the patience that he showed created an opportunity an opening for himself and finished it brilliantly um, and he continued there really all evening with his with his performance I think they really um, you know they made it difficult in terms of the fouls that they were giving away and or the fact that they were holding on to jerseys and then letting it go, he was just pulling people back and making it difficult because they couldn't live with us, you know. And I think that's um, that's got to be said. We didn't get enough free kicks from those situations because the play went on, and um, and thankfully we, uh, you know, we, we went on to keep playing some decent football. But the goal we conceded was a poor one from a really from a corner. We didn't defend it properly. Or the ball came back in, hit Josh Eccles, dropped down to their player, and, and he he scored. Uh, that was really the only bit of disappointing play. They had one or two other bits of sight as a goal and shots from distance, but other than that, it was uh, it was all us. We got we had some really good possession, um, some scintillating bits of uh, of play. We've got Callum O'Hare who was on fire, linking up with with Casey, linking up with with Hadji, linking up with with Torpy and Josh Eccles, and, and I thought I thought Jada Silva played his best game for us. The, the cross for Hadji's goal was the icing on the cake. And two goals in between that with uh, from Callum, you know, just after half time, and then it was a seven minute spell. I think we get the three goals, and, and really the game's put to bed. We had other chances, there was one or two other chances as well, just leaning back Ellis and, and Fabio. But um, I thought it was a really decent performance. The only sour on the sour note with Jamie Allen's got a fractured cheekbone, so Deshaun Bernard has, uh, has just left one on him. It needs looking at because it's was naughty. Deliberate. It's naughty. It's really naughty. I want people to have a look at that, and then do something about it. Again, just leaving things on players is just ridiculous, and that's um, yeah. It's just not on. He's got a de he's got quite a depressed fracture, and, and um, I'm just hopeful he doesn't need surgery. But he, you could see that he was uh, he was in some pain, and it's just there's no need for it. We dealt a fairly comfortable win in the end. Yeah. Um, well, we played them now for. Fourth time, so um, we knew what they were going to bring. We knew um, how the game went um, at our place the first time round. We um, we kept the ball well. They're not as aggressive as they are at home. So um, yeah, we had a great start with Casey's goal. We uh, we slipped up with um, with an unlucky goal, uh, not clearing a set piece right. But then we come out in the second half really aggressive. Um, got our main men on the ball, got them turned and running at their back four or five, whatever they played. And um, yeah, they, they did their stuff. It was um, four great goals. Mm. You went in at half time 1 1. It was quite surprising that it was only 1 1. Both sides could have uh, <laughs> been amongst uh, more of the goals in that opening 45. Yeah, definitely. Um, AD said at half time there was way too many chances for an away team at home, and um, uh, we all agreed with that. So um, we tightened up as a back four, um, got one of the midfielders to be a bit more of a, of a pivot player, and then uh, went more aggressive on the press. And um, a lot of turnovers that we made because of that change uh, led to a couple goals. Which were yeah taken brilliantly. Yeah, you say very aggressive on the press. I mean, three goals in the space of eight minutes that just killed off Sheffield. Yeah, and that's what we needed, especially in these cup ties. Um, everyone knows anything can happen, um, especially playing a team four times. It's it becomes really difficult. Um, but I think the boys were class tonight. They're, we did what we needed to do. We got the win, and we're we're not in the hat. We know we've got mates down now, mm. and um, yeah, we look forward to that.